Today we are going to construct frequency distribution table. Then find the relative and percent frequency. Draw the bar and pie chart using Excel. Here is a question. Comments received by 20 students in their end semester math exam are they use the letters G, V, O, P, A. G is for good, V is very good, O is for outstanding, P is for peer, poor and A is for average. So these are the comments received by 20 students in their exam. They are listed here. We have to construct the frequency distribution table, the relative and percent frequency and we have to draw bar and pie chart. So first of all, list all the comments in a column. So I have written all these comments, G, V, O, P, G, G, same order I have written here. Don't miss out any. Next column, which are these? Just write down. We have O for outstanding, V for very good, then G for good, A for average and P for poor. Now we need to know for frequency distribution table, these are the comments we need to know how many times each comment is. That means what is the frequency. These are comments. Frequency. I will write F for frequency. How many times O is in this data? For that, how to find it? We select a cell. Put equal to. Highlight all the comments. No, sorry. First we have to go to count if. We have to give command. That is count if. If you write count if it has come see now highlight all the comments go back put comma we want o is how many times in this data now press enter you will get the answer so o is two times check is it correct Yes. Now go to the next one. Same way, put equal to count if C O U count if. What do you want from here? From the raw data, I want how many times V is. So select V, close the bracket, press enter. It is three times. Same way we will try for G equal count if. Next step. Select now comma. What it is like? G. Close bracket, enter. Next, A equal count if. Select. Go back. Comma. Select what? A now. Close the bracket. Last one. Equal count if. Select, go up, comma, select P, close the bracket, press enter. So it is four times. Total how many are there? This, these are raw data, comments in raw data. This is our raw data. We have to organize it in frequency table. Okay, now let's check the total frequency like this. 
so you bring it to the next cell go to auto sum it is given 20 is it correct so the 20 comments and we got total 20 this table is called you can select all this is called frequency table you can just put this in this middle make it bold and if you want to increase the size you can increase the size this is called frequency table this is total frequency you can highlight this with some color now we have to find relative, relative frequency relative frequency how do you find relative frequency equal we have to select to divide it by total frequency that is 20 press enter so 2 by 20 is point 0.1 here you can just drag it till the last and it will come so 3 the relative frequency of v is 0 0.15 now next is percent frequency percent frequency percent frequency uh, we put equal we have to multiply relative frequency by 100 so select relative frequency for multiplication is so star by 100 press enter so it is 10 percent now just drag it it will come bring it in the center this is percent frequency if you find total of this it should be 100 let's check and go to auto sum see this 100 percent total is 100 now we want to draw the bar and pie chart so for that we have to select frequency table which is this one go to insert and go to bar you can select which one you want you can choose any one and it has come this is you can place it wherever you want to you can move this table here you can make it small this is bar chart see o is two times you can see the bar v is three times g is six right so maximum students got g now if you want to draw pie chart similarly you select frequency table yes go to insert pie which one you want let's select this one and move it where you want to put it i want to place it down here so this is pie chart C O V G A P denoted by the colors. So this is pie chart of the data. I hope you have understood. Thank you.